Have you ever wondered about the best places to visit in France? Picture the allure of quaint towns, magnificent chateaus and gourmet delights. Imagine the romance of Paris, the charm of Provence, and the glamour of the French Riviera. What if you could explore the 17 most captivating destinations that France has to offer, all from the comfort of your home? Well, you're in luck. Get ready to embark on a virtual journey to discover the 17 most incredible destinations in France. Starting off at number 17, it's the iconic Mont Saint-Michel. This awe-inspiring island commune in Normandy is nothing short of a real-life fairy tale. Rising dramatically from the middle of tidal flats, it's crowned by a gravity-defying abbey, a marvel of medieval architecture. But it's not just the sight of this Gothic spire that's breathtaking. Mont Saint-Michel is also a testament to human ingenuity, a place where each stone tells a story. The island's steep and narrow streets echo with the whispers of centuries past, leading the curious visitor on a journey back in time. And let's not forget the stunning vistas of the surrounding bay, especially during high tide when Mont Saint-Michel becomes an island once again. Here you are not just a visitor but a part of an ongoing narrative that stretches back over a thousand years. Mont Saint-Michel, a place where history and beauty meet. Coming in at number 16 we have the picturesque Gorges du Verdon. A jewel nestled in the heart of France, this canyon is a spectacle of nature's grandeur. Carved by the Verdon River, it's a tapestry of turquoise waters cutting through towering limestone cliffs. Its beauty is breathtaking and humbling, a symphony of color and form that leaves you in awe. Framed by wildflowers and verdant forests, the Gorges du Verdon is more than just a feast for the eyes. It's a sanctuary for the soul. The fresh, crisp air fills your lungs, the gentle hum of the river soothes your mind, and the sheer magnitude of the landscape makes your heart flutter. Whether you choose to explore its depths by kayak or admire its grandeur from the many scenic overlooks, the Gorges du Verdon provides an unforgettable experience. It's a place where you can lose and find yourself at the same time. A paradise for nature lovers indeed. At number 15, it's the wine lover's paradise, Bordeaux. Hailing from the southwestern pocket of France, Bordeaux is a city that dances with the rhythm of wine. Here, wine is not merely a beverage, it's a way of life. The city is nestled within one of the world's most prestigious wine regions, boasting over 7,000 wineries. It's a place where the delicate art of viticulture is passed down through generations, like a cherished heirloom. Every corner of Bordeaux is steeped in wine culture, from the cobblestone streets lined with wine boutiques to the bustling bistros serving dishes perfectly paired with local vintages. The city's heart pulses with the annual Bordeaux Wine Festival, a celebration of the region's rich wine heritage. As you traverse through the vineyard-draped landscape, you are invited to indulge in tastings and tours, immersing yourself in a world where the grape reigns supreme. Bordeaux, a place where every sip tells a story. At number 14, we have the fragrant lavender fields of Provence. Imagine stepping into an impressionist painting, where a sea of vibrant purple stretches as far as the eye can see. This is what it feels like to be in the heart of the lavender fields of Provence. The air is heavy with the sweet scent of lavender, a fragrance that's both soothing and invigorating. Walking through these fields is like taking a journey through a natural perfumery. The sound of buzzing bees hard at work adds a charming soundtrack to the experience. These fields aren't just a feast for the senses, they're also a testament to the beauty of nature's simplicity. Their symmetrical pattern, created by the delicate rose of lavender, is a sight to behold. As the wind rustles through the fields, it's as if the lavender waves hello, greeting you with its intoxicating scent. And as the sun sets, it paints the sky with hues of orange and pink, creating a breathtaking backdrop against the purple fields. A sight that's worth a thousand words. At numbers 13 to 10, we have the charming towns of Colmar, Annecy, Giverny, and Rouen. Let's start with Colmar, a town where the magic of the Middle Ages still lingers in the air, its cobbled streets lined with half-timbered houses painted in shades of candy. Next up, Annecy, often dubbed as the Venice of the Alps, with its crystal-clear lake and canals winding through the town, framed by snow-capped mountains. Moving on, we find Giverny, a haven for art lovers, where Claude Monet's enchanting gardens bloom. The town is a living painting, a testament to Monet's impressionist vision. Lastly, we have Rouen, a town rich in history and Gothic architecture. The place where Joan of Arc met her end, Rouen's ancient streets whisper tales of the past. These towns are more than just dots on a map. They are experiences, 
each with its own story to tell, its own unique charm to offer. Each town, a postcard perfect destination. At number 9, we have the City of Love, Paris. Picture this, winding cobblestone streets, the soft glow of lanterns illuminating historic architecture, and the Eiffel Tower standing tall in the distance. Paris is a city that seems to exist purely for love, where every moment can feel like a scene from a romantic movie. It isn't just the iconic landmarks like the Eiffel Tower or the Louvre that make Paris the city of love. It's the charm of intimate cafes, the enchanting Seine River, and the allure of quaint bookshops tucked away in narrow lanes that make it so special. Paris invites lovers to get lost in its beauty and to create memories that will last a lifetime. But Paris isn't only for lovers, it's a city that loves you back. It's a city where you can fall in love with life, where you can fall in love with yourself. Paris, where every street corner is a piece of art. At numbers 8 to 5, we have the golden beaches of Nice, Saint-Tropez, Biarritz, and Cannes. These are the gems of the French Riviera, famed for their sun-kissed sands and azure waters. The beaches here are more than just splendid coastlines, they are a symphony of senses. In Nice, the pebbled shores of the Bay des Anges offer a unique beach experience. Here, the sea whispers tales of the city's rich history. Saint-Tropez, on the other hand, is a playground for the rich and famous, where the sun paints a golden hue on the luxury yachts docked in its harbor. Biarritz, a surfer's paradise, is where the wild Atlantic waves meet the tranquility of a charming seaside town. And then, there's Cannes. Best known for its international film festival, its beaches are a picture-perfect blend of glamour and natural beauty. The French Riviera, where sunsets are the best storytellers. At number four, it's the Alpine wonder, Chamonix. Nestled in the heart of the French Alps, Chamonix is a haven for thrill-seekers and nature lovers. This quaint town, framed by snow-capped peaks, exudes an adventurous spirit that is hard to resist. Here you can feel your heart race as you ski down the slopes of Mont Blanc, the highest peak in Western Europe. Or perhaps you'd prefer to take a leisurely hike through the lush alpine meadows, where the air is crisp and the views are simply breathtaking. Chamonix is not just about outdoor pursuits, Within the town you'll find charming chalets and bustling bistros serving hearty Savoyard cuisine. The aroma of melted cheese from a bubbling pot of fondue can be incredibly inviting after a day spent in the great outdoors. In Chamonix, the mountains are your playground and every day is a new adventure. So pack your bags and lace up your hiking boots. It's time to answer the call of the wild. Chamonix where adventure calls, sure. And now, the top three. At number three we have the historic Normandy beaches. This locale is a poignant reminder of history, where the D-Day landings of World War II took place. Today, it's a serene coastline, dotted with memorials and museums that speak of a time of great sacrifice and heroism. It's a place that stirs the soul, where the echoes of the past blend seamlessly with the tranquil beauty of the present. Moving on to our number two spot, we find the stunning Chateau de Chambord. This architectural marvel is a testament to the grandeur of the French Renaissance. With its distinctive French defense architecture, ornately decorated interiors and vast gardens, this chateau is a timeless spectacle. It's a place where you can stroll through history, marvel at artistic brilliance, and revel in the sheer magnificence of human ingenuity. And finally, at number one, we arrive at the breathtaking French Alps. A place that is not just a destination, but an experience. In the winter, its snow-capped peaks are a paradise for skiers and snowboarders. In the summer, its verdant valleys and crystal-clear lakes beckon hikers and nature lovers. It's a place of endless adventure and ceaseless beauty, where every turn reveals a new vista that is more stunning than the last. Each of these places, Normandy beaches, Chateau de Chambord, and the French Alps, hold a unique allure. They tell stories of the past, celebrate the beauty of the present, and promise unforgettable experiences for the future. And there we have it, the 17 most incredible places to visit in France, each with its own unique charm and beauty. Each destination offers a different facet of this enchanting country, inviting you to immerse yourself in its rich history, diverse culture, and breathtaking landscapes. So, whether you're a history buff, a nature enthusiast, or an adventurer at heart, France has something for everyone. It's a country that never ceases to amaze and inspire, a place where every journey becomes a story worth telling.